Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is VMware Horizon View Training and this is seventh video in this series and in this video I'm going to show you how you uh, how to install VMware Horizon View client on end users machine. So basically um, Horizon client as a uh, as a client application which allow you to communicate with the Horizon con uh, connection server and a published application and desktop so we are going to see how how we can install this and how we can use this uh, to connect with the connection server so uh, horizon view connection server so here is my demo environment which we are going to use in this demo so the first machine which we have is our active directory server which is our uh, win 2 dc01 which we are using since second video so you can see active directory and dns role is running on this machine and we have a uh, here win 2 12 dc01 so this is my domain controller and next we have uh, our horizon connection server uh, which is win 2 12 cs01 so here is my connection server win 2 12 cs01 connection server so i'm going to launch the horizon 7 administration console and then i'm going to log in here by my credential service account which is view admin and that password for view admin so this is the infrastructure right now which we have we have added in last video we have added our uh, vcenter server, composer server, security server and connection server all are good in healthy state and now to connect with this uh, horizon views uh, infrastructure from a client machine we require a uh, application which is a uh, horizon view client so we have two thin client machine both are windows 7 embedded and you can see the host name is win7 th01 and win7 th02 so these are two thin client machine and both is join in my domain so let's verify here so this is my th01 which is win7 th01 and it's join in my domain and same way we have our second server uh, second thin client machine can see here th win 7 hyphen th02 both are having 20 gig drive and this and you can see both the machine in join in my um, compute uh, at directory so if I go here under the workstation you can see both the computers are joined in my domain and we have few users account here which is end users user 1 to user 5 I have logged in by these 1 and 2 accounts to my uh, these servers so you can see this is logged in th01 is logged in by user 01 and th02 is logged in by 02 so these are uh, these two are simple end users they don't have admin access on their computers and we are going to s see how we can install and uh, use the connection server so so I have already downloaded client in my download folder and I'm going to run this Horizon view client so as uh, as discussed this account having no admin access so uh, it's prompting for password to install this application so I'm going to put my credential and you can see welcome to the Horizon view client setup wizard click next accept the license term and which version you want to use so our uh, visa uh, this horizon view is running on uh, IPv4 so we need to select IPv4 here and then click next and USB redirection you want to allow or not and user as as current so login as current user so this is good and now you need to put the default horizon connection view server so I am going to copy the name for my uh, connection server so is the name I'm going to put here and click next and set the default option as a login I'm going to select and click next I'm going to leave the settings default so this is going to install and to verify the installation you can go and 
verify from the so the installation is finished so I'm going to close this and after installation it's required a reboot so you can go here and first verify the application is installed so here you can see VMware Horizon client so this is good and we can go ahead and reboot this and same way we are going to do on our TH02 so launch the setup give the administrative credential and finish the setup so we need to put the default uh, connection server so leave everything default and click on install so it's going to install the setup and once the installation is completed you can see a small icon on desktop which is Horizon, uh, VMware Horizon client so I'm going to reboot TH02 also and TH01 is rebooted so I'm going to log in now and you can see the setup icon here so I'm going to launch this so you can see the server is added and if I double going going to click double click on this icon it's uh, going to connect basically so it's saying could not resolve name so I guess having some issue here with name resolution so let me check my DNS name DNS IP address okay so the thing is you need to make sure this is going to be like correct IP address and uh, or the host name so this is good uh, so we can remove this we don't require this and click ok ok so you can see the name resolution is working fine but we have typed in correct name so I'm going to correct this once again so this is the complete name so I'm going to add this and now you can see we have we got connected with the horizon view so this is good and you can see this is you are not entitled for use this system because we have not deployed any desktop or any RDS VDA anything in this infrastructure so we uh, our user account is not entitled so this is fine we're going to add soon so I'm going to delete this account so this is good we are able to connect with the server and let's verify on this machine also so we need to delete this and add again the complete name which is in 2k12 cs01 dot victor info soul dot com and you can see we are able to connect and also nothing published for this user as well so this is how we can install uh, this horizon view client on end users machine so um, horizon view also support for iOS mobiles uh, Android mobiles Mac everything so Linux so you can go to uh, VMware website and you can download the uh, uh, like a uh, client as per your requirement and you can install on those devices to access this connection server so you just need to very uh, put the connection server details and you are good to go and if anything is published for you like uh, desktop pool or RDS or application you can get, um, uh, get those things from um, the client and in next video we are going to deploy some RDS farm and we are going to publish few application for these two users and we will verify how we how we can um, basically publish the application for these user and how we can how user can launch uh, the application by using this VMware Horizon client so uh, also we are going to publish some desktop in on upcoming videos so this is good so this is all about how we can uh, install VMware Horizon View client on end user machine 
and thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any question related to this video you can always post me on my given mail ids thank you once again bye bye